Peace and blessings. This is Nubia I of the Blackberry Beauty Holistic Academy, ancient African healing for the modern sister. So yes, we are in North Carolina, my husband and I, and we are on the eight acres, um, I'm sorry, 18 acres of land. And so I'm walking down the road. Uh, we just actually walked around the land. This is our second day doing it. We did the first day, which was yesterday, which was Thursday. And then we did the second day, which is today. And we, we took, it took about an hour, maybe an hour and 15 minutes a day. We took a little longer. We actually went through all the bush this time. And oh yeah, talk about getting out in nature. My wild women who run with the womb. I'm sorry I haven't been so active. You know, we actually left Tuesday, but we didn't get in, of course, till Wednesday. So we got in Wednesday morning and uh, had a little jet lag, of course. And then Thursday we were out, um, you know, in our on our land. And then Friday we were out today on our land. And so we'll be here for a few more days. But uh, it's it's amazing and it's magical. You know, as I walked on the land, you know, you're going through jasmine bushes and blackberry, raspberry bushes and all the beautiful smells. I know I said with the beautiful perfume and the jasmine smell, I said to myself, I know nature's a woman. Nature has got to be a woman. I mean, I think it's actually a balance, you know, it's a, it's a male and female energy and I really love it. And so right now I'm just walking down the road and... I know y'all can see all the beauty behind me. This is actually our road to, that leads to, the, the, to our land. And um, actually it's a sheer road because the other house shares the same road as well. But I just decided to get out the car for a minute and just come to you. The weather in North Carolina is beautiful. It is overcast, but it rained a little yesterday, but not a lot. We, were, we walked in the rain, y'all. I have my rain coat on, okay? We walked in the rain before, and today was no rain, just overcast, but it's warm, it's humid, and it's just so beautiful, and I just wanted to share this experience with you. It's so healing to be out in all this nature, and I'm very, very thankful. Like I said, we just got back from our hour and a half walk, climbing over bushes, and, and, and we have a stream, y'all. We have a stream that runs through the land, and we were just sitting by the, well, we wasn't sitting a lot, we was walking and talking and enjoying life and I wanted you to be a part of it. I know you can see the road in the background, you can see the green in the background and I wanted just to come to you real quick and say I'm just giving thanks and praises, you know. I tell you, like I said, there were so many times walking through the land that I actually wanted to cry and it was tears of happiness and joy and healing and when you have that it's the most amazing thing in the world and so I'm giving thanks and I'm giving praises to you all for just being patient with me out there and for not really participating in the group in the last few days, but just kind of getting my bearings and that jet lag, you know. Wow, we cannot wait to be out here. We cannot wait to have our home, and we are just looking forward to it. It's a beautiful, beautiful life and a beautiful adventure. And I'm so glad you all come with me and sharing this time with me. It's, it's pretty amazing. So the land, the land, the mighty land. Oh, ancestors, be with me, us. Be with me, be with us today. You know, I know it's the ancestors that called us to this land. I know it's the ancestors that made it work for us and made us be able to have it. Don't give up. I know there were some sisters saying, I'm feeling down, I'm feeling doubtful, I'm feeling like the things that I want in life I'm not going to get. Don't give up. The miracle of us getting this place was something I can't even explain. That's how I know if it's what somebody also answered the sister when she said she was going through the doubtful feelings. She said, I know what's for me is for me. And that's the best way to put it. I know what's for me is for me. Make that your mantra. I know what's for me is for me. So it's really beautiful. Oh my God, I could hardly talk. You know, I was thinking, y'all, God, I remember when I visited Trinidad, you know, quite a lot of times. Um, I remember the feeling that I would think, wow, if I could take Trinidad, the nature of Trinidad, and I could have walking in the hills of California, and, uh, and those two things together, and it's all the beautiful natural places that I've ever been, it would look like this. And now we have it, and it's just, it's mind-blowing. It's better than anything I've ever experienced. You know, something to walk on land that's yours, that you purchased, that you own. Wow, like, 
There's nothing like that feeling in the world. And we're talking about getting out of nature, exercise. I'm walking. My body feels so good. It's so thankful that I'm walking and doing this. And so I just wanted to share a few moments with you, you know, just to be out in nature and giving thanks, you know. Also, we've been eating at the very wonderful restaurant in Durham, North Carolina. It's called A Vegan Flavor. Thank you, Sister Maliki Grant. You, girl, we've been eating there. Sister, we've been eating there every single day. <laughs> every single day since we got here. And we'll do that every night and every day before we go. And that place, those the brothers and sisters are, are, are vegan flavor. Oh my. And the love, the love that the Southerners have given us, the love from the sisters and people we're meeting. It's just been Southern hospitality all the way. And to Erica Harris Blige, I just want you to know that this is the good, right place for you. This is the perfect place for you. And wow, and all my neighbors I'm having, my sister friends, and I feel like everything I want, everything I need, me and my husband, we know we can have. So don't give up. Know that you can have this and much more. I love you all. So I'm going to actually walk back and I'm going to take you all with me. So this time I'm just going to, um, yeah, oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> oh Lord, I just, I feel like we've been blessed, you know. Life is good and the joy and the happiness that I have. It's going to be very hard to go back to Cali. But right now, I look at Cali as the blessing that it is and was and know that more blessings are coming. So I'm going to give you a chance to look at I'm going to walk and you're going to walk with me. So let me point the camera the other way so you can experience the walk with me. Thank you. Peace and blessings. All right, y'all. Thank you. Blessings. <laughs>